I've actually been associated with uh, War India for the last, I would say, 12 years or so. I've been uh, in my previous role in other organizations also. When I was in the vendor side, I actually got a lot of uh, you know information and updates by being associated with War India. And now being a War myself, okay, in the company that I represent, again we are able to get a lot of insights. You know what's happening in the market from an OEM perspective, from the distributor perspective, and also from a partner perspective. So from War India, the latest happenings which are happening in the market, you know the trends that are happening. I think that is something that a company like us, you know, which is a value-added reseller as well as a service provider, we get a lot of insights from because of uh, the efforts of Bar India. Uh, cyber security is according to me the topmost one of the reason is because we are also associated associated with cyber security but besides cyber security you know the inclusion of AI which is also one of the important aspect of uh, the trends perspective also operational technology which is OT cyber security as well as the IOT uh, security as well so I would say that these are the main trends which are happening we are also seeing a lot of AI uh, related threats and AI related risks which are coming up in the market so I, I would say these are the top two or top three trends which we are actually witnessing in the market. Uh, margins because you know that is how we need to survive you know from a marketing uh, perspective uh, second is uh, you know from the uh, support for new technologies and the new products which are being entering into the market because every product that is developed you know is something good there is a lot of effort that has gone behind it so one of the pain points that we as varc is that you know we get let, get a lot of products that come to us because of the efforts of the distributors and because of the oem but we don't get a lot of technical hand holding on these new technologies so i would say that is the second uh, uh, pain point and uh, third would be you know, probably be you know, some kind of credit related stuff because getting payments out from customers is also a big uh, challenge which we are facing today. So support uh, you know, from the vendors as well as the OEM uh, as well as the distributor would definitely be something that we would be looking out for from an expectation perspective.